So I've not done a workout this morning, so I thought I'd do a speed training session. I've got 50 balls, um, I've got my 7 iron out, so I'm going to see what I can get to. I've just been warming up, the most I was getting to was about 108 ball speed, which is pretty poor. Average on tour is about 120, so I've got a little while to go. And Bryson's at about 165, so I'll see what I can do. Um, I reckon I can get it up to about 120 by the end of the session, but give it a go. So I'm down to my last few balls. Uh, most of them manages 124, which is a good few miles an hour quicker. What's that, 16 miles an hour quicker? So I'll put the camera down and film a few. Me going out and see what I can get it to. Twenty-five. <sighs> Done. So I've just played nine. Um, figured out how to not to use the zoom function, so you're not know, get a horrendous picture of my face zoomed in. So that's good. Um, just played nine. I was just focused on um, speed work because I just did that speed session before. So I wasn't focused on the score. I just wanted to see if just just hit it hard because that's my problem. I get a little bit guidey on the course. So I had the swing speed monitor out. So there was some good numbers about. It's averaging about 160 with driver, give or take. So, like the bad ones are 157, good ones 161. So, that's a good improvement on sort of last year where I was probably about 150, 155 max. And to be honest with you, I've not done any speed work. That was the first speed work I've done in oh, I don't know how long. So, that was good as well because of the gym work I've done. I've been able to, to actually hit 50 balls hard and not, not have any pain, which is a good sign. So, just keep it up if I can get, um, y'all, I'm going to start super speed training. So, they claim, they claim 5%. So, where my club head speed is at the minute is 110. So, 5% is about 116. So, if I could do that by open qualifying and translate that to ball speed, I should be nearer the 120 mark. Should be around 116. So, ball speed about one. 170 ish, so we'll see. We'll see. So I'll start that probably next week. So positive, positive, but you gotta keep grinding. So, done my last exam today, so I just thought I'd come out and do nine holes. Not scoring, just trying to hit it as hard as I can, just having a bit of fun really. Um, not actually been doing that bad. A couple of fell off balls where I was just trying random things like um, trying to play a big slice and and uh, play a hook, so nothing there, uh, nothing to worry about really. I, I'm, I'm enjoying just hitting the ball hard. I, I think I get a bit too technical sometimes and then just end up just guiding it and end up spraying it, so I think that's something to take away, just especially the driver. I'm pretty wild with it anyway, so I'm just gonna start hitting it hard, see what happens. I'm, <laughs> I'm only hitting sort of, two or three fairways around at the minute so I think I can manage that going full pelt and then at least I'm getting a little bit more yardage out of it so I'm just doing that for the time being so some positive stuff um, next week get proper practice in I think get um, I think I'm going to start speed work properly instead of just playing about with it um, next week so I'll put some, uh, some bits in the vlog for that playing with with Nick on Monday, so I'll video that as well. Nick's the Scotty Cameron rep, so that should be fun. And he's my best mate as well. So I think I'll call it for this week. This is probably going to be be it. So we'll have a chilled weekend. I might do a bit, I might not, I don't know yet. So yeah, I'll get onto it proper first comp on the 12th of May. So peace out.